Hey campers, welcome to day one of our findings. What I want to focus on for, for today's evidence dump is all the weirdness surrounding the WCKR radio station. So, as you know, we had a DJ, it was DJ Ollie, but then we got this fancy new auto robot AI kind of DJ, and his name is DJ, right? And because of that, Ollie got bumped off of his primary duties and ended up having to do all of our grunt work for us, which was great because then I had a soda boy. That was awesome, but there was something off with, with DJ. And the one thing that we do have here at the radio station is recordings of everything that we broadcast. And so I've been spending a few hours going through this and there's some weird messages that he was apparently sending out. So I want you all to listen to this and, and just see what you think. In addition to that, we had some other guests on the air and they were telling some stories and news and updates from around the camp, as well as there were some strange brands that were advertised. Um, I don't know, maybe this doesn't mean anything at all, but I feel like the radio was such a big part of, of the camp experience and that's how we, sh we shared a lot of our updates. And I just wonder if we missed something. So go back and listen to the clips that I've selected and see if you find something weird. Because to me, it sounds like Ollie definitely sabotaged this entire thing so that he could become the DJ again, right? DJ is missing, and KMK says they turned him off for updates or something, but I don't buy it, right? Seems to me like this whole thing was a setup so Ollie could run the camp, but you all listen to this stuff and you tell me what you think you found out. I appreciate your help. And we are one day closer to that beautiful, beautiful movie night.